California's budget surplus this year could be a lot bigger than state leaders projected. State lawmakers are working to decide the best way to spend it. 17's Ashley Zavala is in our Sacramento Bureau with the latest and what it could mean for you. Governor Gavin Newsom's administration has forecasted a $45 billion budget surplus for this year, but a recent update from the Legislative Analyst Office shows it could be billions more than that. With tax season underway and California collecting revenue, the state's budget surplus seems to be swelling. In its February update, the state legislative analyst office says there's a very good chance money collected from state personal income, sales, and corporation taxes will exceed the governor's projected revenues by anywhere between $6 billion to $23 billion. In the update, analysts wrote, although we are halfway through the fiscal year, much uncertainty remains as the most important collection month, April, is still ahead of us. They also noted it's still very likely state lawmakers will have to reckon with the state's appropriations limit, which restricts the amount of tax revenue the state can spend. But it's hard to tell what the future holds with respect to the pandemic, with respect to the economy, and it's early in the budget process. Legislative leaders in the Assembly and Senate weighed in on this last week. If the state hits the limit, one option for the over-collection of taxes could be rebates back to the taxpayers, or what was known last year as the Golden State Stimulus. But legislative leaders say it's too soon to say if that's a possibility. That we are going to look at this through the lens of equity for the hardest working Californians who have not rebounded, who are continuing to suffer. So stimulus is part of that, but it will be through that lens and, and trying to make sure that we're able to cover those bases um, thoughtfully and to make a difference in real people's lives. Lawmakers noted stimulus can be a driver of inflation, which the state and nation are grappling with now. But they say they're more concerned about Californians being able to pay for necessities like rent, food, and transportation. I'm certainly concerned about inflation. But at the same time, I know that there are bread and butter everyday issues that, that Californians are suffering, uh, suffering from on a daily basis. The governor has said there will likely be some contribution back to the taxpayer, but in what form and exactly how much is something he'll have to work out with the legislature. They have about four months to figure it out. In Sacramento, Ashley Zavella, 17 News.